In 2014, Skylar Nemitz was the defendant in a high-profile murder case, accused of shooting his 19-year-old wife, Danielle. The details of the killing garnered national attention. Danielle had been shot in the back of the head with an assault rifle. Her husband claimed it was accidental. In my ear, I'm hearing we have special guests joining us, Mark Lindquist. Prosecutor Mark Lindquist talked about the case on the Nancy Grace show, and some believe what he said violated the Washington State Court rules of professional conduct. Oh, it's going to be a long road. Attorney John Kane filed the complaint with the State Bar Association. He has a desire to prosecute people, he had, but he has a desire, I think, that that clouds his vision of what is fair because he wants to make a name for himself. In a 66-page letter, the Office of Disciplinary Counsel cited transcripts from the Nancy Gray show, showing Linquist went beyond the facts in the court documents, discussing possible motive, speculating on what Nemitz was imagining, and suggesting his knowledge of firearms was critical to the case. According to the findings, Linquist made the comments against the advice of his own staff. The concern? It could prejudice a jury and jeopardize a fair trial. As I think anyone who would, would be looking at that w would obviously think that the person was, was guilty. Uh, and it turns out that he was convicted of manslaughter. The judge presiding over the Nemitz case denied the motion for a mistrial. None of the jury said they saw the Nancy Grace coverage of the case. The prosecutor's office declined to comment. However, Linquist's attorney chalks the complaint up to a political attack. He said the disciplinary counsel review is supposed to be confidential and that there is no chance of Linquist getting suspended. Kane admits he was part of the failed recall effort against the prosecutor, but said this complaint had nothing to do with with politics. There's a significant character for him. The inability to admit that you've made a mistake, the inability to listen to others. In Tacoma, Alyssa Hahn, King 5 News.